What's up everybody? Saturday, November 26th, and today we get to use power tools. That's right, we're going to tackle the backyard. So how many people does it take to change a light bulb? Well, how about a whole light? We'll find out here. It's time to head off to a three-year-old party. Woohoo! You excited, Isabel? Yes. Look up here and tell me how excited you are. I'm You're so excited, huh? Jeremiah, are you excited? Back there? Yeah, you look real excited too. Is it really Christmas time already? It's like 75 degrees out right now. I'm wearing shorts. I don't know about that. So we took about 45 minutes to an hour to change this light. Let's see if we're the mastic or electrician now and it works. Light! Ah, we have light! It worked. Guess I can call myself an electrician now. I mentioned earlier that it's been like gorgeous weather here. It's so nice that we decided to fire up the bobby and we're going to make us some food. So we are going tonight in search of the perfect grill marks on our yummy delicious barbecue chicken. So I'm gonna teach y'all something tonight that you may not know. So let's show you how you do this. First, just take your chicken, pull it out, and you just lay it on there and let it sit. Get it laying flat, and don't touch it again. For at least, well, you gotta touch it again, but not for a little while. Now comes step three. Remember, step one, lay it flat. Step two, turn 45 degrees. Step three, take it and turn it over. And look at the grill marks starting to come on there. Uh huh. Kind of like baby jail, just keeps them inside. Poor Hannah, she can't come out either. Mmm, grilled chicken. Mmm, grilled chicken. Yummy, yummy, yummy in my tummy, tummy, tummy.